Okay, we are here in case number 98, DR0803, Tamara Talty versus Sean Talty. Mr. Talty is present today, proceeding without counsel. Ms. Talty is not present, though she's notified of the hearing. Child Support Enforcement Agency is represented by Assistant Prosecuting Attorney Nick Buckmeyer. We're here for the purpose of a purge hearing um, that actually, I believe, is already a continuation of a, of a um, previous purge hearing that arises from a uh, contempt action, I think, last year? Or was it earlier this year? It was like last year, man. Yeah, I was going to say it's been a while. I guess the entry went on March 14th of this yeah, year. Yeah, I just okay. All right, Mr. Buckmeyer, what do you have? Your Honor, thank you. I recommend that Mr. Talty has failed to purge his contempt charge. Mr. Talty was ordered to make four monthly payments of $399.60. Mr. Talty has paid a grand total of $850, which is approximately 50% of his required payments during the four months. Mm -hmm. All right, Mr. Talty, could you please rise and raise your right hand? Do you swear or affirm to tell the truth? Yes, ma'am. Okay, be seated. Um, what's the trouble? Yes, we already. No, um, last time I was in here, mm -hmm. you gave me the 60 day grace period, the 60 day continuance. Right. See, the 399, Mr. Kimmler, when I was on probation and I was in jail, my child support was a modified to 350 a month. My total payments, I have three cases, was mm -hmm. something like 580 a month. So. And then when I seen you last time, I, I was starting a big job. I do siding and construction. Well, that took three weeks. As soon as I got a payment, I made, as soon as I got paid the first week of November, I made a payment. Mm -hmm. I can make a payment today of $200 too. I got paid today. You I have money on you? Yeah, I can pay $200 today too. And I was also going to pay. Do you have the money with you now? Yes, ma'am. Do you want to give it to the prosecutor? Yes, ma'am. And um, now it would oh, be a good time. I, I don't have it on it. My wife has it out there. Okay. But I just like to explain to the courts. I mean, I'm trying. I have, I have seven kids. And the line of work I do in the weather, it's not an excuse. It's not, I'm not here saying it's an excuse. I'm trying. And I tried to make as much as I can last month. It was just the, the work I do, the siding and stuff, and with the weather, it slows me down. Sometimes I'll work three weeks and I don't get paid till the job's done. Okay, Mr. Talty. I and I notified, excuse me, I'm sorry. I notified, like you said, I called my caseworker over at Child mm -hmm. Support and they got with my employer. So now my employer is going to start taking the chip money, like you said, straight out of my check. You, you told to me you were going to do that the last time, though, and that was one of the conditions of the purge. No, that was, you told me to do that on the last case court hearing. Correct. And I did that. I did that. I, so it's coming out by wage withholding now. Yeah. I, I, Mr. Buckmeyer, is that correct? Um, it's it's hard for me to distinguish if it's coming out through wage withholding from the payment printout itself, Your Honor. Um, I'm not sure. Can I yes, see Your Honor. The because when I went to talk to child support and I went to make the I made a $200 payment, I talked mm -hmm. to the lady there and tried to see my caseworker. They said I had to fill out a little blue card. I filled that out to show them mm -hmm. that who I'm employed with. Mm -hmm. And then they're supposed to get in contact with my employer. And he's aware of all that and everything. When did you do that? I did that in the middle of November, I think. Yeah, I don't think it's kicked in yet. And um, they said that. They said that they'll get in contact with my employer. My employer has been getting back and forth. So he's just waiting on the documents to come from them. And he's just going to start taking it right out of my check directly. That's, that, the only that's thing. That's what we're trying to get from you. Yes, ma'am. And I'm, try I'm trying now. I mean, okay, before I decide what to do, could you get the money from your wife? Yes, ma'am. It's a prosecutor. Your Honor, uh, for the record, the Mr. Kaufman, um, Mr. Kalti mentioned that the Well, wait till he comes back. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I mean, I'd like to apologize to you and I'd like to apologize to the prosecutor. I mean, I really am trying. And I have work now from the address. I don't mean to keep interrupting or anything. 
I have I have a lot of jobs that I'm doing now, and now we're doing a lot of smaller jobs, so it won't take me as long to be able to pay. I'll be able to pay December by the end. I mean, as long as you make it within the month. This is what I'm going to do, Mr. Talty. Now you're over 50 percent, but you're you're not quite getting a home run yet. Yes, I'm going to give you another 30 days, and I specifically want to see the wage withholding. Yes, ma'am. If you get the wage withholding on, yes, then I will consider you purged. Okay. okay? Can I address? I don't know how to. Do. It's okay. Go ahead. I'm so far behind on child support. I know. I mean, that. I'm never going to come out, and I I don't want to go to jail. I can't afford to go to jail. I mean, I really am trying. I mean, that's the only thing. I, I see that. If say. you get the wage withholding on, as far yeah. as now, I'm how concerned. do I do that? I mean, I filled out the blue card. I mean, that's the only thing they told I me I'm supposed to do. Yeah, it, with your employer information. Yeah. So they should process it. Mr. Buckmeyer could probably call the agency to make sure it's happening. Yes, Your Honor, I can. And. I'm going to ask Mr. Buckmeyer to give you his contact information so you can keep in contact with him. Okay. And if the wage withholding goes on, then I'm going to find you purged because I know the money's coming out and you won't have to come back the next time. Yes, ma'am. I'd rather have you out working, okay? Yes, I, I appreciate But if the wage that. withholding doesn't go on, then I expect to see you here and you're going to have a consequence for being so far behind because, okay, no. frankly, it's not our problem that you have seven children. I know, ma'am. I, I never said it was. I mean... Now, with the wage withholding, is that that blue card? Because I'm kind of, I don't understand the whole I system. don't know what color card. You I would mean, best talk to Mr. To Buckmeyer it? about it. Give him also your employer information, yes, and he can also give it to the agency to make sure it happens. Yes, ma'am. Okay? Okay, thank you. So if within this 30 days we see that you get the wage withholding on, you won't have to come back, and Mr. Buckmeyer will call you okay. so make sure he has a phone number. All right. And um, if it doesn't get done for some reason, then we'll be back in 30 days. Yes, ma'am. Okay? Yes, thank you, ma'am. Can I get a receipt for that? Yeah, you can write something out. You'll yeah. get credit for it, absolutely. Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Well, hold on, Mr. Talty. Yeah, you guys.